How does it sound to you to be able to translate any video from your computer or YouTube into 220 plus voices across 40 plus languages and even be able to live stream it to YouTube, Facebook, Twitch, and by any RTMP streaming server, all of this in just a few minutes. All this sounds too crazy to be true, right? Well, let me show you. I'm inside my Streamer by Vidtune app account now. Here you can see, I can drag and drop a video to start or select a video from my computer. I can even use any YouTube video, but more than that, I can also look for Creative Commons videos from YouTube on any topic I want. I would like to translate a video from YouTube into another language. So I will add the YouTube video URL. Click on Next. I will select the quality of the video. Click on Download Video. And click on Video Translator. And there you have it. Let's give our project a name. And also, I will pick the current language of the video I just added. English United States is the default one. But if you upload a video in another language, you have to pick that language in which your video has been created in. My video is in English, so I will leave the default option. And click on Create Project. You will then be redirected to the timeline. In order to translate your video into another language, you would need to generate subtitles for the original video. For that, click on Generate Subtitles and click on Start. Awesome, that was great. Then click on Close. And there you will see all of the subtitles automatically generated by the Google Cloud Services in just a click. You are even able to edit each line if needed to make it 100% perfect. Now, I would like to get this video translated into Spanish. For that, let's click on Subtitles and click on Translate. Select Spanish and click on Start Translation. And that was quick too. So, click on Done. Great, now it's time to generate the Spanish voiceover for this. For that, click VoiceOver and click on Options. Select the gender. Select the voice name. You can now listen to how the voice would sound by clicking on Speak It. Te gustaría presentarte. And if you like it, click on Save Changes. Click on VoiceOver again and click on Generate VoiceOver. And click on Generate. Great. That was easy, guys. Let's preview it. Te gustaría presentarte. Eres famoso. This is just awesome, guys. Let's try another language. For that, pick the original language again here. Click on Subtitles. Translate. Let's try Italian. And start translation. Great, let's generate the new voiceover now. Vorresti presentarti. Vorresti presentarti. Sei famoso. Di alcuni versi di animali puoi fare un lupo rosso che ne dici di un gufo i graziosi uccelli canori che ne dici di un gallo. Che ne... Sai fare un cavallo. This is just crazy cool, guys. If you would like to edit the volume of the audio of the original video, as well as the volume of the audio of the voiceover generated, you can do so by going to the Video tab. Here, you can even hide the subtitles too. Finally, you can save your project, render it into MP4 format, or stream it.
I want to go live with this video, so I will click on render and stream. Okay, now the video will render and then I will be able to stream it. Great, now let's go live with this video to the whole world. As you can see, you can add an intro video and an outro video to the main video we want to stream, but that is optional. To go live, you need to select which account you want to go live. I will select YouTube and click on Start Streaming. And we are live. Let's take a look in YouTube. And there you see the live video. Sei famoso. Che ne dici di alcuni... And your followers can see in your account you are alive. Ma fa male quando fai un gatto su un cane. Did that hurt? Ow, ow, ow. Now, let's do it on Facebook. And we are live on Facebook too. Che ne dici di bussare alla porta? Aiutami ad avviare. Now your Facebook friends can see your live video as well. And shoot the lasers? Can you do water? Che ne dici di bussare alla porta? Aiutami ad avviare la macchina. Penso che possa aiutarmi a chiamare. Well, that was terrific, guys. You can do the same with Twitch and with any other RTMP streaming server. You just need to go to the manage area of your streaming accounts. Add new. Click on platform. And in custom, you will be able to do so. I can't wait to keep playing around with this awesome tool. So you better grab it. It's just amazing. See you on the other side.